before we start the review, don't forget to subscribe on my channel and don't forget to come all the way up here to this little bell thing so you will know when a new review comes along. Let's continue. What's up, everyone? Acid Burn here, coming 101. Blah, 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 blah. I can't even talk today. Jesus. So, anyway, so my friend talked me to Target and showed me this because he's like, dude, I just saw a matchstick car thingy. I was like, no kidding. Let's, let's go see it. So, we drove a little out there and showed it to me. And, dude, the original Ghostbuster car. And I did not know it was from Metal Diecast. Metal Diecast are actually like. Like, it's like real metal toy. Like, they're bringing it back to old school style. Thank God. Echo 1. Let's see. There you go. Screw it. Why would I want to do that? And, uh... 2018, I'm over like, there. So I'm going to take it out so I can get a better look. Can I take it out? There we go. It's not easy doing this with one hand. I have no knife, so I am screwed. Okay. What if I go like this? Yay! There we go. Or, oh, more tape. Killing me. Is there more tape on the bottom? No. Good. Oh, okay. Jeez. I shall use my thighs to open it. We'll save the box though. Pretty cool background, guys. I guess the door doesn't open. Oh, you have to stand for it and everything. Apparently, the doors don't open. The wheels roll, which that's a plus. If you haven't seen my friend's review, yeah, he bought a Batman um, vehicle, and the wheels do not move whatsoever. And he spent over like sixty to eighty bucks, I believe. Stupid toy. Very stupid. So, kind of don't want to take the bottom piece down. Just want to show you it, but it looks like the door opens, so. Oh, it does. Hey, look at that. Nice. Both doors open. Yeah, it's metal. You see the proto pack in the back. Doesn't look like the back door opens though. So. It doesn't look like this door opens either. Hmm. a nice stand on the bottom so you like level it up so it won't roll off your table yeah the back doesn't open get a good zoom in the front doesn't open oh look at it go one New York This is actually pretty cool. Does it have a, it has a little weight to it? Not like the action figure metal ones, though. Be careful with this because it looks like it could break the top part off. And we don't want that. 
steering wheel. The camera's zooming out wrong. I said, yeah, dude, you guys get this. I don't remember. I think it was like eight bucks, maybe. Maybe less. I honestly never saw, seen this before. I, if I had seen this before, I would have got it already. Shocking enough. But yeah, both will actually roll. So that is the big deal right there. Why would you make a car with the wheels don't move? Which doesn't make any sense. Way to go, Batman. Way to go. So that is it. Just want to share this with you guys. So yeah, so you, some of you old school Ghostbuster collectors out there who likes to buy the Ghostbuster with the real Ghostbuster people in it. You know what I mean? Hey, you know what I mean? Yeah. Well, this is actually the Ghostbuster one. I don't know. No. Doesn't show Ghostbuster two on here. Nothing at all. Yeah. But, uh, keep your eyes open. I'm pretty sure they will do something with it. Yeah, it's like some kind of button back there. I'm trying to get the light. Actually, I got a better idea. Reflection might make it worse. Yeah. I don't know. But the back part doesn't look like it would open, which is kind of sucks because I kind of hoping the back would open so that we could actually pull out the proto pack. There's like no lines to crack open. I mean, if you look at the door, that's you could tell it could open like right away. Not that door though. But the back piece, yeah, it doesn't look like it opens at all. The door over on the other side opens. Anyways, yeah. So I just want to share this with you guys. This is absolutely the coolest thing ever. ever. Um, I'm hopefully they will make like a bigger size one. You know what I mean? So there you go. With a Ghostbuster Echo One metal. Um, yeah, I don't know what else to say about it. I would say if you come across this, and you're like, yeah, I don't know if I want it. Get it. Get it for your collection, guys. You know you want to. And you know the rules. If you see one, get it. Because you guarantee you'll never see it again. So get it, get it, get it. Ah, I love this thing. Hey, everyone. So thanks for watching the videos. Uh, I'm going to tell you this real quick. At the end of the videos, if you want to scroll down, then here's like it says like uh, the name of the toys. And the review is right here. So if you want to see other stuff that can really relate to this video that you're just watching my review, just so scroll down and boom, it goes right into it. So you can check out other stuff. You have all the different folders, themes, 2007 to 2003 stuff, Movie Star, Rare, Limited, Outprint, I mean all these. So feel free to dig in and scope around and see what you know, which theme you prefer. My Pet Monster. Everything you can name. I have it all listed. Mad Ball folders. So, yeah. Dig around, my friends. Dig around. You'll, you'll see some good stuff. Stuff from the, you know, flashback stuff. So that is it. That's why I introduced you to that.